hello everyone so today we are going to look into how to replicate uh, this strategy template this moment of uh, characters that we have so as you can see here this is the server instance and this is the client instance so when I uh, I can control the same set of units from both sides so this is somewhat like a co-op game mode where the both players can control both uh, all the units so we can build together some army and control together we can have that kind of a play gameplay so yeah anyway that's not important so what we are going to look into is how to replicate the moment of these characters and across uh, different instances in a multiplayer environment all right now without doing anything here if i just set the number of players to two and network mode so i think we have to at least one of these to actually get the multiplayer replicated mode if i play i here i do have the control this is considered the server but in the other window i don't have it see i don't have control so and put some errors as well right so now the reason that it didn't work is because here i don't have a default pawn class so i need to have a default pawn class and it is bp player pawn that's the player pawn class that we have been using in this game and uh, to make it easier for recording i'll choose the new editor window so i can get two windows side by side when i play now you see here we have two windows and both are working so this is server this is client so i can select and move the players you can see here this is client this is server so you can see when I move these characters these characters are moving around and the movement is replicated here but here I can't I can select but I can't command them see nothing is happening even though I want I click select and right click so why is that let's oh here we have go to event all right so to allow moving characters from the client side so this is the part which moves the characters we call this move to function and all the selected actors are moved and if i call this from the client side it's not going to replicate so we have to call this from the server side because the other characters are not spawned in other characters are not owned by the client they are already in the game world so i think they are owned by the server actually i'm not 100 percent sure so but somehow if i call this function go to function on the character it only works on the server so okay now so to allow moving from the client instead of directly calling this function well actually we can still call this function if we are the server so has authority switch has authority if we do have the authority we can simply call this otherwise we have to have a different setup uh, we need 
uh, to run this motor function on the server so how can I do that let's create a custom event move to server and run on server so and we need to pass this cached destination otherwise this will not be replicated from client so uh, to make it easier I don't feel like typing so there we have cache destination then we can call to. so this will be running on server so we can actually see that since we have some icon appears on the clicked location so to server but still this won't work because select adapters are not replicated so auto test here let me select this guy and click over here now you see pay attention I'm gonna click here I'm gonna click near this character pay attention to here you will see that a moment icon appear see so that means the left side is the server right side is the client so the event is uh, replicating but no moment is happening here it still works so the reason the no moment is happening because inside this move to we have selected actors and that is no, that part is not replicated. So let me promote this one also to a variable. Mm. Let's name it selected actors. Now we have the selected actors, we can simply pass it here. Let's get some space. And we do need selected actors for this one also. Right. So this dots represents because I set it to be replicated but it's not going to work from the client side so okay now let's see see now the moment is replicated from the server side and for some reason we don't uh, we don't see the when we click we don't see that this uh, this icon from the client side so if we need to see that we will have to replicate that part too but it's not that important for this case anyway see so yeah this part should be this should be spawned in a multicast I think but we can simply just copy this and paste here that will also work so it should work but if you want to do it in a cleaner way you will have to have another replicated in it 
See, now we get the icon. Right, and both players can control these characters, same characters. So it's somewhat like a co-op one. We can play together, we can build together the same village or whatever the units you have, you can control with your friends. So that's the kind of gameplay we would be having with this mod. Alright, so that's how you replicate the movement of the characters and control the strategy game in a co-op mode. So, thanks for watching. As always, project files will be available for the download in the Patreon page. Link would be in the description below. And if you like to support my work, you can get the membership of the Patreon Club. See you in another episode. Goodbye.